The K-Rain Pro-LC Wi-Fi enabled controller can be operated using Wi-Fi by adding the bridge Wi-Fi module or it can be run manually. This video will demonstrate advanced manual programming. Increase or decrease station run times globally for all stations. Run times can be reduced to 10% or as high as 200%. Turn the dial to seasonal adjust. Press the up or down buttons to set the percentage in increments of 10. In this example, seasonal adjust has been set to 80%. Return the dial to auto. Turn the dial to special features. Press the up button to add a delay time. Delay times can be set from 1 second up to 9 hours. Press the down button to add an overlap time. Overlap times can be set from 1 to 9 seconds. Return the dial to auto. Turn the dial to special features. Press next until pump is displayed. Press the back and next buttons simultaneously to enter the pump on off feature. Press the back or next buttons to select the desired station. Press the up or down buttons to activate on or deactivate off to bypass a station. Return the dial to auto. Turn the dial to special features. Press the next button until sensor is displayed. Press the back and next buttons simultaneously to enter the sensor on off feature. Press the back or next buttons to select the desired station. Press the up or down buttons to activate on or deactivate off to bypass the station. Return the dial to auto. The lighting feature works on program C and allows you to make any station within C a lighting program. It runs only on program C and overrides any commands or programs that are on program C, including the pump master valve terminal. Turn the dial to special features. Press the programs button and select program C. Press the next button until light is displayed. Press the back and next buttons simultaneously to show the word station at the bottom of the screen along with the number one flashing. Press the next or back button to toggle through the stations until the station you wish to use is flashing. Press the up button until light on appears. Using the up button again will deactivate the lighting feature for that station. Return the dial to auto. Turn the dial to special features. Press next until clear is displayed. Press the up or down button. An asterisk will be displayed. Press the next button to clear the current program. Once next is pressed, the unit will always display the next available feature. In this case, the next feature is the save feature. Return the dial to auto. Turn the dial to special features. Press next until save is displayed. Press the up or down button. An asterisk will be displayed. Press the next button to save the current programs. Remember, once next is pressed, the unit will always display the next available feature. In this case, the next feature is the restore feature. Return the dial to auto. Turn the dial to special features. Press next until restore is displayed. Press the up or down button. An asterisk will be displayed. Press the next button to restore any previously saved programs. Return the dial to auto. Turn the dial to special features. Press the next button until day off is displayed and a flashing MON for Monday is in the upper left corner. Press the up or down buttons to turn on the day off feature. The MON is now solid, non-flashing. Press next to advance to the next day of the week. Repeat until all non-watering days have been selected. 
Return the dial to auto. The loop feature provides a solution for places such as greenhouses where periodic irrigation throughout the day is required. Turn the dial to special features. Press the next button until loop off is displayed. Press the up button to have the word loop on displayed. Press the back and next button simultaneously to go to the next screen. The display will show PGM A to the left of the screen. A will be flashing. Use the next or back button to toggle through A, B, and C for the loop program. Use the up button to confirm that program. Press the back and next buttons simultaneously to move to the end time setting. The screen will show end off. Use the up button to adjust the end time. Once end time is set, push the back and next buttons simultaneously. The screen will show delay. Here is where you can insert the minutes or seconds required between the end of the last station and the repeated start of the first station. This is an optional step and not required. Return the dial to auto. From this point, you can set the program start time, set watering days, and set station run times as desired.